Hey guys, it's me again. Um, wanted to do a vlog because I'm feeling happy and excited, and I feel like there's a change in the air. And um, let's see. So, um, a lot has happened since my last vlog. Surprisingly, since it was only a few days ago. But um, let's see. Well, I guess I'm sort of single right now, which is weird because some interesting things have happened with my relationship and basically there's a lot of confusion in well there was a lot of confusion in it going back and forth and I guess in the end it was just better the way it's now and I don't know now I guess we both have an opportunity to move on and I'm kind of excited like it's interesting like I know once you let go of something, new opportunities come to you, and it's kind of exciting. Like, I'm looking outside and seeing all the trees in front of my house. I'm just going to show you. They're really pretty. And, you know, it's just kind of reminding me, like, hey, life goes on. Um, so anyways, what else, what else? Um, I'm studying for my midterm right now. Um, it's a tech and architecture midterm. I'll show you some of these. This is what I'm studying right now. Like these details right here. I have to be able to draw them. This stuff. This stuff. It's basically not too hard. We've been learning for four years about it. Um, so I'm excited about that. I'm having some study groups this weekend. I know. Um, I got my hair cut. I got my hair cut at this little place called Scissors by one of my close friends named Pedro. And he's a really awesome guy. He's been working with me for a few years doing photographs of me. Um, he just, he, he sees things that other people don't see. Like, I wouldn't normally consider myself, like, a model or whatever. But, I mean, he doesn't either. He sees, like, the things that people have inside them, and he can show that in a photograph. Maybe I'll show you guys sometime. There's some really neat pictures. Anyways, um, so yeah, I went and got my hair cut. I like it. I really do. I like the back, actually. It kind of angles up. We we had an intense discussion while we were figuring out what to do and we talked about life and about my relationships and my mom and everything. It was just nice. He's always good to talk to. Um, what else? Uh, so much has happened. I uh, ran into my ex-boyfriend Jordan yesterday and it's sort of one of those things where I was I was thinking about him a few days ago, and I was like, hmm, that's strange, I don't normally think about him, and I was like, I wonder if I'll run into him, and like, lo and behold, yesterday, I'm walking up the stairs, and like, if I would have been like a minute later, because I had just on a whim decided, okay, I'm going right now to get food, and I just ran into him, like, whoa, that's weird. Anyways, you know, we all have those. Um, so he was doing good, and it was sort of interesting, just because... It's almost like when you're trying to move forward in something, your past comes back to you. Just to remind you, like, okay, you, you went through this. You went through this already. Just don't forget. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know. I've uh, added on one of my favorite, it's, it's like a little video thing, and it's for The Secret. I don't know if you guys have read that book, but I read it this summer. I was really apprehensive. I didn't want to read it at all. I was like, oh, that's stupid, like, I'm already a positive person, how can I be more positive? But it was really good, and it kind of showed me that, like, every thought you have sends out this signal to the world that's, like, positive or negative, and you can bring anything you want to you, and that's really empowering to me, like, I can have what I want, I don't have to be like, oh, I'm a nice person, I should just be happy with what I have, like, if I want to move to Paris, I'm going to move to Paris, damn it. <laughs> Anyways, so I watched that link and it sort of gave me some empowerment in my life. Again, every time I see these things, they're like just at the right place. Anyways, if you guys have time, just check it out. It's my most recent favorite. It's it's long. It's like 20 minutes, but if you just watch a few minutes of it, it's interesting. I don't know. What else? What else, guys? I just feel like change is in the air. It's, it's good. 
I feel like things are starting to happen. I had an amazing night last night. I went I went out to my friend's art show and I didn't really know who I was going to meet there, but in my head I was like, I'm going to run into my friend Steph. I really want to see her. And it was so random. I got off the bus. The bus went down this detour, which I'd never been on. I randomly got off at the right street. I was just like, I'm going to get off here. I walked up the street, and like walking down the street was my friend Steph. And I was like, oh my god, that's so awesome. <laughs> and so we went to this art exhibit together. And then I was like, I really want to go somewhere after this. Like, I need someone to come here. And then like, right after I thought that, this group of my friends came in, and they're like, we're going to another art show. Come with us. And I was like, wow. I was like, you ask and you shall receive. It's just... And then we went for faux after. And I had been wanting vegetarian faux for so long. And we just so happened to go to the right place that had it. And I was like, in heaven. And then I walked all the way home. I don't know. It was just really good. Anyways, I don't know. I hope you guys are feeling this sort of changing vibe. Like, there's just change in the air. So, I don't know. I hope you guys are having a good week. And keep blogging and... I don't know, I hope you're enjoying my blogs. I'm trying to show you what's going on. School's busy, but it's happy, and it's my last year, so yeah. Anyways, have a good week, guys, and I'll talk to you soon.